Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new here, my name is Emily and we're here for a massive Timu Christmas haul. So I wanted to get this video filmed for you guys because as you all know, if you're not new to this channel, I love to decorate for Christmas on November the 1st and that is coming up very, 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 very quickly. So I wanted to film all this stuff so I could get it with all my other Christmas items and we could finally decorate but I wanted to get it out and show you guys what I got from Timu this year. So I have got all of these packages so I think I'm gonna go in with some of the smaller ones first. Also what do you guys think of my makeup? If you didn't watch the previous video I did full face of makeup using only Timu products and that video is actually coming out after this video so keep your eyes peeled for that and see what I thought of all these products. So I just filmed that a moment ago. So here's a sneak peek. I will just say, I did kind of touch it up because I filmed that video a while ago. Right, if you're unfamiliar with what Timo is, I will quickly just say it is like an online marketplace where you can buy everything and anything you can even imagine under the sun. It has it. Hundreds and hundreds of sellers, every single item, hugely, hugely inexpensive. My new favourite place, you've probably guessed, because it's all over my YouTube channel, I'm getting hauls here, there and everywhere. So, I will leave my links all down below so you can go over to Timu yourself and get these items. So the first thing here is actually for a window, it's a window sticker. It's going to be really hard for me to show you without unrolling it and I am not unrolling it. I'm trying to block my face so that the camera focuses on the reindeers there we go so if i kind of roll it you kind of see what it will look like i'm just gonna pop that on my kitchen window does it have the measurements on here no it does have them online i did look it was quite a decent size um but yeah that's a roll of window stickers you will see that on oh yeah also if you're interested in seeing what this stuff looks out like out and about come back on the first you know we're decorating um another item i got which is actually to go with a couple other things in there so I have a vase in my living room which I always like to have fresh flowers in um, but I'm thinking for over winter I'm going to have fake flowers and I saw these feathers and are they feathers or are they flowers I don't even know but I thought they were stunning and you get so many I think there's like 20 in here and when they're all together look at that and I'll show you the other things they're in there somewhere else. Um, but yeah so I thought they'd look nice and Christmassy fit the theme and I actually got a fish. I haven't even shown you the fish, but I decorated the fish already. So all the items are of Timu, but I'm not showing you them because I decorated Mr. Fishies. Um, but their whole tank is Christmas ready. They've got, uh, they've got snowmen, so they've got an igloo, everything's white, and the vase is gonna go behind them. So on the first, come back, you'll see the fishies as well. I don't know where to pop everything. I've moved my setup, I don't have a sofa next to me. Pop them at the back there. Um, so the next little thing I got is this cute little train. Um, ah, I lost it. Um, <clears throat> literally just a little train ornament. Super, super, super cute. Again, doesn't want to focus. There we go. Look at that. So cute. And this was like two pound. Super inexpensive. I have another one in there somewhere. Everything just got shipped very sporadically. Um, another t-shirt. You guys know I love my Timu t-shirts. This one is a festive one, kind of. It says, dead inside, but jolly. Yes, that's me. Now it's Christmas time. So I might pick up loads more Christmas t-shirts because you know I love t-shirts. But I got in this kind of like um, dark grey. Um, how would you describe it? So it's a dark grey colour, but it's kind of like you know, like almost like the textury where it's got like the whites going through it and the darker colours. And it is super soft as always, and the print is super vibrant, super colourful, and I just love it. I just love it. Can't go wrong with the Timu T-shirt. They're absolutely amazing. They're my fave. Love them. Um, I've got two doormats. This is the first one. It just says Merry Christmas. It has been folded. So that's another reason I wanted to film this video so I can get everything out and it can air because like my rugs that came off Timu, they also had creases in and they've completely gone. They were just gone. So you leave it out and the creases obviously all pop out. Um, so I'm not worried, not concerned because I'm just assuming it'll be the same. And it just says Merry Christmas and it's got this like black and red checkered patterns and these Christmas trees. And I thought that was super, super cute. So that is number one of the doormats forgot the name of it a second then right okay next package 
So these are to go with the, where are they? They're like blended, here they are, look. Blended into the wall. These, so I'm not even sure how the vision is gonna work, but like in my head, it was them. And then some gold leaves going through and I'm terrified to open this because it's literally glitter. Can you see all that glitter in the bottom? Glitter everywhere. Um, I might get one out. Oh, very carefully. Um, I'm not mad about the glitter. I love glitter, but yes. So I thought I was going to put some of these sticks in there as well. They are so shiny. Look at all that glitter. You see that with the light on it. Um, against the wide, I don't know how it's gonna look. I think it's gonna look magical. That's what I hope anyway. I had a vision. We'll see how it all comes together on Wednesday. Get back in there, you glittery glitter stick. <coughs> <coughs> so here is the other train. This one came all cute and packaged in a box. This one, however, did not, um, but they are basically the same thing. Um, this one is kind of like all white and gold. However, this one has a few more detailings on. Let me get out this bag so you can see. Um, whereas like some of the little guys are, um, like they're all painted and got a bit of detail given to them. Try and get it to focus, there we go. It's a little like details and faces and a few different colors, but this one's essentially just red and white. Is this wood? Is this a wooden one? I think I got a wooden one. Yeah, actually this one's a wooden one. That's cute. So this is like full wood and this one is plastic. So this one is a little bit more sturdy, is that the word? A bit more heavy duty. Um, and again, you just like interlock it in. That one's a bit more um, like of an actual like wooden Christmas ornament. Very cute, like that one very. The other one you can't tell from far away, uh, but up close you can definitely tell that that's a plasticky toy kind of one. Whereas this one you can, I could tell, I was like, yeah, that's wood straight away. Um, definitely more on the sturdier side if that's what you're looking for. Um, a tiny bit more expensive than the plastic one, but both very cute and on a shelf you definitely wouldn't even be able to tell if you're having them both as little ornaments. Um, so what's in here then? Okay, I think this is more arrangements for the florals. And I can't remember without looking on my phone, which I cannot do right now, because it's broke, what these were. I don't remember what these were. These look like they dead. <laughs> look at that. What? What is that? Um, I don't know, it's all right. I don't remember what these were. Um, Is it a duster? I'm really not sure. It kind of looks a little bit like dead and unhappy. So I don't know if you're supposed to... Is it pompous grass and it's supposed to come back to life? I'm really not sure. Um, but at the minute, it's looking a little bit sorry for itself. Ah. Um, I'll have to look at the picture and see what this is supposed to look like, but I'm assuming it was supposed to go in my vision. Um, however, those two colours don't go. The pure white definitely looks better. So this might look better in my bathroom once it's all popped up and out. Not entirely sure what this was or what I ordered. So, sorry about that. There's that one. Right. This absolutely huge bag of Christmas stuff. So here are, I'm really excited for these, the Christmas pillowcases or cushion covers, should I call them? They're not pillows, are they? Um, it came in a four pack yes four and here is the first one this home is blessed with the spirit of christmas they're all red and this kind of like um potato sack kind of color so they all match so that's the first one the next one is this one it just says merry christmas with like antlers and stuff this one is another one which is just antlers it's got like the christmas lights and baubles and then the fourth one is just this red one with the snowflakes. And I thought they were really nice. They're obviously going to take the place of the Halloween ones we have at the minute. Um, I'm going to leave these to sit out. Um, if the lines haven't got out, I'll just give them a quick steam. So excited for them to be out. We also have a table runner. Um, I will just say it was a little bit underwhelming. It looks very cheap, very... 
I don't even know, but like on the picture, this like tartan material looks really nice. Whereas here you can definitely tell it's just like a print. Um, but I did get this table runner to go down the table. Um, and it's got these little like reindeers on the end and things like that. So just bear in mind if you do click on this, it definitely, you can tell, looks very like printed. Is that the word? Not very like, I don't even know what the word is. Like it just looked more rusticy and Christmas vibey. And then when it came, it just was kind of printed. I mean, I'm still going to try and make it work. We'll see. We'll see. Um, but there is that. So I got that runner for the table. Um, I picked up two pieces of decor for the walls. Um, I have a perfect place to hang them over there. Um, we can take them out of the packaging now. So they're just in these wooden frames. So they're just in these wooden frames. It's real wood and it comes in the frame. And this one says, believe in the magic of Christmas. And I believe it's just paint or been printed onto the wood so that's very cute and then i've got this second one which i'm going to hang next to it over there which one just says christmas calories don't count so i thought they would look super cute on the wall as little bits of decor for christmas time very cute um i picked myself up some christmas slippers you know i love the slippers i'm wearing my halloween ones at the minute with the little pumpkins on so i had to get the exact same ones because these are my favorite slippers so far but i got them in a christmas theme and these ones have rudolph's on so i'm really excited to be able to start to wear these on wednesday i love spooky seekers and you know i'm the spooky queen i'm everything spooky but i'm spooky all year like all year halloween isn't like I mean, I get to be a little bit extra spooky, I suppose, because we've got bats stuck on the wall. But I'm just always spooky anyway. I love that. I love skellies and all the witchy stuff and all of that. So Christmas, it's nice to have a little bit of a change and go like full cheese mode. Full cheesy cheese mode. Um, What else? So I did get this doormat as well. This is doormat number two. Um, When it came, I did actually reach out to Timu because the print on it did seem like in the picture it was very vibrant very red so you'll see what i mean and when it came it definitely was more muted um it's like a rug i'm trying to get it all in without covering my face i'll show it you first and then i'll carry on talking so there it is and it's definitely more of like a rug rather than like a doormat so this is definitely going to be for inside but all of this right in um on the picture is like bright vibrant red and when it came it's like i said definitely a lot more muted um but luke seems to think that it doesn't really matter and that it will look fine so i'm sure it will be absolutely fine but just a heads up um for this one um it is really well made it's really sturdy and all of that it was just literally the color of the print is not as bright red as it appears in the picture um but if you don't mind that and you quite like how it looks here then sure by all means go ahead i just like to give you the truth so you know exactly what you're getting yourself into but that is doormat number two i will still use this of course <coughs> i got a new sign for the coffee station so i'll be taking down my even with the seed coffee sign and replacing it with the hot chocolate bar this is like proper tin i'm going to be hanging this um like i said on the chocolate stick on the coffee station but it, i turn it into like a hot chocolate bar at christmas with like marshmallows candy canes squirty cream all that good stuff so that's gonna fit perfectly in there and i just thought the print was super cute with the gingerbread man in the cup and i just loved that one so i got that and a couple more items in here what did we get so i actually picked up three of these and um, they are door frame hangers i don't even know what you call them they fit around the right angle on a door frame so i got two um right-handed ones and one left-handed one so they're going to go on different corners of the doors and they are let me take one out of the packet to stop the glare i'm not even sure how these fit together but they seem to come in two parts Oh, it's just literally like a jigsaw so you just put that in like that she says and then can't get it in just push it but 
there we go and then um it goes around the corner of your doors and it's just like these gingerbread men and then they're like hanging down the side and i thought they were super cute so i picked up three of them like i said and then it does also come with these sticky tabs which is good because my witch one up there didn't have any sticky tabs and uh, she did fall down once actually luke noticed her getting closer and closer and closer and closer to the edge like it must have been when the door shut and things and then uh, she did uh, plonk off the other day but it'd be good to just stick them down um i'm not going to show you this one because it's a bit rude um but it is a funny santa so uh, i'll leave it linked down below if you want to see what's in here um <laughs> The George. No, 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 because what if it gets demonetized? Okay, fine. Luke says I can show you, so I hope it isn't like I don't know what the rules are with YouTube. So it's this little Santa. He's <laughs> just happy it's Christmas. He's just very happy. <laughs> it's this little Santa dude. Look, it's an ornament. How precious, made of wood. Looks lovely. It looks like one of them bobbin people you know the ones made out of that the wood bobbins um but then you know you get a, like a whoo, whoo, he's very happy it's christmas whoo, whoo. <laughs> how many times do i whoop before i move on whoo. i'm not saying anymore I'm just showing it you there we go he's a happy happy chap well i just thought that was hilarious and to be fair this was quite expensive this was nearly six pound but i just couldn't not get it because it's hilarious um and there he is and then just like when my grandma and granddad are around all innocent and cute and it's just hanging on the tree and they've got no idea that lurking underneath is actually a cheeky little surprise and it's only there if you know it's there you know what i mean you don't you wouldn't go up to a decoration and start pulling its head off would you but if you know you know and i thought it'd be like quite a cute gift as well like obviously this isn't a gift and we're just going to put this on the tree however you could get that as a really funny gift. <clears throat> um, and then I also got this garland. This is literally just a paper garland. Um, I don't know if it's even worth taking it out because it isn't stringed. I am going to have to string it. But I thought this would look really cute in the kitchen. Um, they're all like meant to be like gingerbread. Ooh, gingerbread cookies. So I was going to hang this garland in the kitchen with all these cookies and sheeps and just have it looking all cute and Christmassy um near the hot chocolate station and just like like a little cozy gingerbready vibe going off in the kitchen for Christmas sorry don't mind me coughing and sniffling I am not very well I'm actually a lot better i'm coming out of it i'm definitely over the worst and the last item i believe this is the last christmas item that i have to show you today i do have more coming however i was not waiting for them to get here because i am decorating on the first and i wanted to show you all of this before i filmed so if i get any more they will just be thrown in with the generic timu hauls that i do which will be like christmas gifts and also just some other christmas stuff um but for today this is the last item and i am obsessed it is by far the single best thing that I got for Christmas off of Timu, this haul, it is a knitted, <coughs> it is a knitted blanket. It, it is absolutely huge. This side is more white. This side is more red. Um, both sides are this gorgeous knitted uh, fabric. It goes all the way across and through and whatever like it literally is if somebody had like knitted this it's absolutely stunning it's huge massive all the good things it's so well made i'm just obsessed with it obsessed this literally makes the whole haul worth it if everything else had got cancelled and just this had come i would have been so happy still it's the best thing ever like some things on team were just epic wins not just wins they're like that was really good value and this is one of them so if you don't get anything else but this blanket from this haul i highly 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 recommend it is amazing i love it i love it can't wait to put it on my sofa in just three 
three days, three days till I'm decorating. So excited. Hopefully I get this video edited and up for you very soon. Planning on it going up on Monday or Tuesday. Um, but yes, if you like this video, be sure to give it a huge thumbs up, turn on the bell notifications, comment down below, let me know which of these items you liked. And I'll be sure to see you in the next video, guys. Peace.